Hi guys, so this is You Gotta Be Kidding. He turns three uh, this winter, so he's only two years old right now. And he's the little fella that I got that I was told is very high string, strung, sorry, kicks a little bit. And we're gonna play with him. This is his first session, first time being in this area. And we're just gonna see what he's all about. All right, little boy, come here, fella.
see that we've got a lot of work to do. The biggest things being that he doesn't know he can cross a pole. So we're going to work on crossing pole. He's actually got a little bit better connection than the other horse that I brought out, Trivia Time. You can see that in the circle game, he was actually trying to look at me a little bit and figure out what's going on. Still hardly any connection at all. Uh, very sort of skittish about a lot of things. You can see he's very flighty and when he wasn't sure he was trying to run away. So when I'm told that this horse was a kicky horse, I don't think he really is kicky. I think he's flighty and then if you restrict that flightiness with a lip chain or you know being too firm on his face then he's got no choice but to kick so I would actually say that his first instinct is to flight away from me which is actually a good thing because I always rather work with a horse that wants to get away because I just have to prove to them that I'm worthy of being trusted rather than a horse that his first reaction is to kick because then you have to sort of show them that they can't do kicking and that it's not a good idea to kick uh, which is a lot more difficult than a horse more like this that's flighty. So we're going to work on connection. We're going to work on trying to show him that he doesn't need to flight away. We're going to try to show him that he can go over a pole. And he also has to learn to follow a feel because you saw there when I was asking him to move his hip over and things like that with a little bit of pressure and he had no idea what I was doing and he either was jumping away from me or he was uh, not moving at all. So we're going to play with that and then we'll check in in a little bit. Thanks, Wendy. Okay, so this is 20 minutes later. responding a lot better to pressure. He understands a little bit of feel now. He's got confidence going over the pole. So a lot of things are going a lot better. I have a lot to work on still. He still is scared of most things, scared of the stick. He also is, um, he's okay with this ear on this side, but this ear, oh, that was a big problem when I just did that about five minutes ago. So that had a, uh, and I'm not sure if that's an ear that used to be twitched or what's wrong with that, but that's a lot better. 
You can see he's still not sure about that. But a lot better than what that was a few minutes ago. Good boy. So we're going to keep working on things like that and uh, building his confidence all around.